Hey, this is Rodney with the Rod Shop, and I was asked to review this uh, these nozzles by YVD. It's a, it's a whole kit. It comes with different nozzles uh, for different size cans. I had one gas can that uh, had this rigid uh, nozzle on it. The uh, the problem with it was is the, the hold down. Uh, actually, it, it kind of cracked right away uh, when I first got it. I tightened it down, so it split. I mean, it still worked, the nozzle is rigid, so it, it makes it difficult sometimes to get into a tight spot to pour. These nozzles are flexible, so you can see that uh, if you need to almost do that, you can do that with it. Um, they all have screw caps to seal them off. The one thing that I really liked in this kit, because this gas can had that rigid nozzle, one reason it's rigid and bent the way it is is because the can does not have an air release in it. So when you if you turn it too fast, you can hear the air, you know, getting having to suck back through and it makes the can go gloop, gloop. But they provide vents for the can. You have to drill a little hole. Unfortunately, the can already has some gas in it, so I don't want to do that and get the plastic down into my uh, gas can. But once it's once the gas can's empty, I'm going to drill a hole and you just poke it in and then it has the little uh, cap that you know, seals it off if you need to for like a you know, haul a can for going getting gas. So this is a great little kit and I'll show you here um, me changing it out on my can and stuff and me using it. And it comes with a lot of stuff. I like that it comes with the, the o-ring seals and stuff in here to go in the caps. I've already put one of the o-rings in the cap here and um, I've already slid this up on just put this through put one of the lids out which was good timing but the problem with these are is this one's cracked I don't know if you can see the crack in there but it's already cracked so whenever you uh, tilt it to pour gas it pours gas everywhere so if you're doing like a motorcycle tank it's gonna get gas all over and these you know the the rigid nozzles kind of nice it doesn't have a good lock and I've, I've had gas pour out because the little cap falls off or the caps get lost. So anyways, I've put this together and the, the funnel stuff already has a seal made onto it. Threads perfectly on the jug. I can feel the seal binding down. Got my little cap. So now when I want to carry the jug, Got these tight. No leaks. When picking your nozzle, they give you different height of, of uh, caps to screw over this. If you get too tall of one, it'll never tighten down on this. So you have to kind of compare and test them out until you find the ones that actually fit the right, fit the best. This one. So there's two of these, that's that one fits the best. It comes with all sorts of little caps, like this one to put on. The nozzles all look the same to me, the same size, the same length and stuff, but it's good to give you enough to do other can gas cans and stuff, but it's kind of nice that it'll stay a little bit like that, because I'm going to pour this into a motorcycle, and we'll see how that does. Okay, instead of drilling a hole, what you can do is probably safer. <clears throat> I went ahead and took the cap off. I didn't want to show it on video in case I blew up, but uh, 
I took this off, emptied the, the can was empty, I let it vapor overnight so there's no gas vapors in it. And I just took a soldering iron <clears throat> and just poked a hole in it, kind of warbled it out while it was hot. I stuck this vent, it's kind of bar fitting, I just stuck it through the hot melted hole and now it's in there. And this gives you a vent. Nice little kit. And because, like I said, <clears throat> the original can was uh, an angled rigid pipe, which is how they, the way that bend in it was allowed to get air to come out so it didn't sit there and go gloop, gloop, gloop. And this doesn't give you that option, but they do give you the vents for the, the jug in case you do have that. <clears throat> These are excellent replacements, and I personally highly recommend uh, getting this kit. So I hope you found the video of me doing this uh, YVD nozzle uh, review helpful in making your decision if you want some. I, I like the kit. The kit's great. Like I said, you got plenty of nozzles. Uh, so if you ever break the one you got or damage it or something, then you have other nozzles to use. If you have multiple gas cans, which I do, I'll probably be putting these on them too at, at some point. Because a lot of mine, some of my cans do have flex nozzles like this, but they're all split by now. And of course, they're also 100 years old. But uh, so if you, if you did find the video helpful, be sure to like and subscribe and always check back. I'm always reviewing interesting products. See you in the next one.